What's up guys? Coming at you again. It's another cars and coffee. It's a small one. I think it's uh I can't remember the name of it, but uh it's a few cars here. We're gonna go check it out. Then later on I'm gonna go for a little drive in the car that I have, the uh 2022 SS. But until then, we're gonna go check this out that's over here behind me. You know the deal. If it's your first time checking me out, like, subscribe, hit that thumbs up. We got more videos coming. Hope you guys uh, stay with me and enjoy this video. All right, later. Wow, look at this right here. Somebody brought out the beast. The Yanko. My first time laying eyes on one of these. If I'm not mistaken, it's a thousand horsepower. Oh my God, this is sickening. Yeah, it's a lot of people were like, I don't know. Yanko, look at that. That's crazy. I got a buddy of mine's got a 65 Yanko Stinger race car. Really? That he races. Wow. Yeah. This is like bananas. Look at that Yanko. Thousand horsepower. You don't want to run up on this. Don't want to run up on this right here. You might get more than what you're barking for. This is a monster. Look at this. Look at this. Never seen one of these in person, in person before. The Javelin AMX. Love the fender bulges right there. This is gorgeous. Yeah, I'm into acceleration, but I'm not into 160. <laughs> wow. That's crazy. Look at that interior. <laughs> Javelin AMX. It's bananas. I like this. They all do. They all do, yeah. You can see it on both sides. Right, right next to the AMX is the Camaro. 69 SS. With the vinyl top. You have to do both quarters and the roof. Look at that. And the jewel right here. Man. <clears throat> Look at this. Just. Ooh, wee. I mean, wow. What, what else can you say? It's, it's a 69. Then right next to it, we have the fifth gen ZL1. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Fifth gen ZL1 right here. It's a beast. Not one you want to run up on. Not one you want to run up on. Go. Right behind that, we got the black SS. Six gen.
Looks like you got the red package. I don't remember what the package, the red line package, I think that's what it's called. I like that. The Decepticon symbol. The dark bumblebee. There's his uh Instagram at Megatron SS. Check him out. Lovely, love this car. Love the Camaros. I'm more of a Camaro fan than a Mustang fan. Though honestly, I just love them both. That's just me being real. There we got one of my favorites. Cadillac CTSV. Always, always love these. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. The track monster right here. The unicorn. <laughs> I love that. I mean, wow, this is this is beautiful. CTSV Caddy. You know? Can't wait till the next iteration of this car right here comes out. Well, the CTS is gone, but they got the CT5 and CT6 and CT4 now, but... <sighs> they did such a good thing with this. Imagine this being all wheel drive. Man, that's crazy. Anyway, right next to this, got the Dodge Charger RT. I love this color. Love this color. The 392. This color is beautiful, man. Beautiful. I like chargers, man. I love the way that they look. I don't know. Just that you. I guess I've seen videos where they can handle pretty good. You know, there's a guy in Germany. I think his uh, name, I can't remember, something Mopar. He takes these around the Nürburgring, passing people. That you wouldn't think that he could pass, but he's a beast on the Nurburgring. ring. But man, the <sighs> charge is just such a good looking car. Wow, bananas. Then next to that, you know, we got the CTSV that we just looked at. Then we got a car that you see on a regular. But don't really get that much love. It's the Pontiac Solstice. I think this might be the GXP. Maybe not. I don't know. But I like these. The GXP is pretty nice. I don't know if you guys remember that Reese Millen used to race one in the... Uh, he used to run one in the D1 drifting competition. Back when Pontiac was a thing. But no, nah, this isn't a GXP. I knew that when I looked at the motor, but uh, I was hoping it was. They just, you know, sad thing to see Pontiac go. Just when Pontiac was headed on the right path. Then, of course, we got another one of my favorites. For the hot hatches out there. Ford Focus ST. Don't look like he's done much to it, but he'll probably get there one day. 
like this what metallic gray gunmetal gray or whatever kind of gray this is Oh, he got the took the thing out for the intercooler. Oh wait, like he took the screen out for the intercooler. Okay. Then the beast, Godzilla. I love this paint. Is this? Oh, I can't remember what that purple is. But it's changing color. It's green. It's purple. It's look black. Carbon fiber hood. Carbon fiber lip. Carbon fiber side skirts. Carbon fiber spoiler. Amazing, amazing, amazing. You know, I've always been a fan of GTRs. Love the 3.5. Love the three, love, love, love the three, four, love the three, threes, three, twos. I, I know that's the one that a lot of people go for because it was the first, first one they called Godzilla. But I like the three, three and the three, fours. I mean, three, fives is cool. I Me, mean, at the time, it was the fastest accelerating car. Still one of the fastest accelerating car. I mean, it's a monster. It was making hypercars and supercars look sick. And I love the carbon fiber spoiler right here. Not too big. This is gorgeous. I don't know if you guys were paying attention, but he drove through here earlier before he parked, so you might have heard it. It's sick, sick. I love it. another great cars and coffee this is a new one haven't been here before i think it's the first time they ever had it wasn't that many people here today i think they had a ou game uh texas versus ou is probably why it wasn't that many people here but um it's great hope you guys enjoyed this video till next time be safe be quick burn some rubber baby we out of here don't forget to like subscribe and hit that bell icon love y'all